Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So the other day I posted up a video that showed my new hand with a mechanical selector system on it. So I thought I'd go over how that mechanical selector actually works. What I have here is the selector off of the prosthetic. So what it is, it's a body, four little rocker arms, and basically a, a cam that advances 60 degrees off of a rotational motion. So you have a catch and you have a lock. So what the what the catch does is it goes down to the next position and comes up and then the lock takes over and keeps it keeps the cam from rotating backwards. So catches, locks, catches, locks, catches, locks. So I don't really have any motion on the hand that goes up and down like that. So, what I'm doing is I'm using a scotch yoke, or actually, a pair of scotch yokes. And I'm driving that off of the same motion that I'm using for the splay. So what this piece does, is it takes the forward and backwards motion, and goes from forward to backwards, which would be from splay to closed, and then that takes it and advances the cam. So, where we go is from here up and then down. Okay? And what that does is then these rocker arms are pushed in and out from, from their position relative to the cam. And what that does is then on the hand, on the metacarpal, there's a clutch bearing behind here. And when this arm is pulled, this little sprag is pulled away from the ratchet gear, and then that would make the finger be able to move open and closed like my normal hand does. But when the when the sprag is contacting the gear, then because of the clutch bearing, when the finger is drawn, then, then it has no choice but to stay in place. So right now, see how the finger is is caught because of that that sprag and clutch but when the cam would pull the rocker arm forward the finger would return to its normal straight position so i hope that helps clear some things up as far as to what i'm doing on the hand there'll be more update videos coming shortly let me know what you think in the comment section thanks for watching